it's your birthday. We're going to party like it's your birthday. We're gonna council meeting after accusing Ukraine of carrying out a terror attack that severely damaged that bridge. I had to rebuild my life over $6,700 a month. Marquise, I know you feel... Like oh, this nigga is crazy. Twenty five years old. Why are you still talking about child support? I was in the bottom down in the year, but it was me. That's why I took his mother to child support because the bitch thought that she was supposed to get that much more. She wanted more. Oh, that motherfucker nothing. Said <laughs> all that motherfucker nothing. Look, for shit. Look, you know I don't ever ask for shit, man. But I was thinking. Nick, can they get a little extra 6700 a month? I'm gonna shut it off fire. I need to play too much. Yeah. What it do and all that? It's your man, Ballhead Tay, Four Wings and Fries. Hit them likes and please hit them subscribes. Hit the notification. Hit that notification bell so you won't miss none of these vibes. When you hit in them notifications, make sure you click all. So whenever one of these shits like this drop, It'll pop up on your it, on your device or whatever you got working, whatever you doing. You feel me? Yeah. Welcome back to the channel. Please share these videos as well so we can get this content out to the world, to people all over the world, in the projects, the mansions, suburbs, all the way out there in Germany, Czechoslovakia, and Madagascar. We need to get this shit to A by. No condoms media. Yeah. Welcome back to the building. My bad, I was just drinking orange juice. Shit got like my glands back here. Hella fucked up. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, I said that. No condoms media. Yeah, no condoms media. Uh, you, how, how petty you gotta be to troll your son on his 26th birthday? Yeah. How petty you gotta be? And he, he man. This man is crazy. <laughs> 50 Cent trolled his son on his birthday. You feel me? And uh, hold up. I done lost the motherfucking page where my shit was at. So, uh, he trolling his son. Marquise turned 26 today. 50 just dropped that Instagram video today. You feel me? With Uncle Murder and Tony Ayo. It, yo, if he do that to, to, to his son, like, he don't give a fuck about nobody else for real. Like, nobody else is exempt from his wrath for pettiness. And I like it. I admire it. Because that motherfucker, he don't give a fuck. And he's successful. And he gonna keep on doing what he doing. And ain't nobody gonna stop him. Ain't nobody gonna deter him from being 50. Yeah, and that's some stand-up shit. So, um... I kind of see why the fuck he feel the way he feel. Like, yo, your son, he took pictures with the, with the dude. Well, the son of a dude who tried to kill you, allegedly. I'm going to say allegedly, but 50 won't say that. You feel me? But well, how the fuck that look? Like, you trying to send me a message or something? I remember it was a post prior to this Instagram post that I let y'all hear. You feel me? He posted a old post from uh, a old scene from Power when Kanan killed the son. I forgot Sean. Yeah, he killed his son Sean. Yeah. Like I felt like that was going a little too far, but eh, that's how that man feel. But hey. I feel like his son being hella entitled to talking about sixty seven hundred dollars a month. That ain't enough money. I like that is like I don't give a fuck where you at. You talking about it's too hot. It ain't enough money for New York. Well, get the fuck out of New York then. Like, that's like damn that. That's, they say that's around $80,000 a year. Like, that's decent money. You more than the average motherfucker. Like, you can man, have a whole life with, with a family. And this is just you and your mother. I, I feel like his mother didn't kick the whole lot of shit in his ear. So, he running around with all of these stories and all of these beliefs in his head that was like trickled down to him from his mother. So uh, I, that's what I feel about the young man. He just turned 26 today. And he's still bitter and he's still having some type of resentment towards his dad. I understand a little bit from a, from a person who didn't have fatherly guidance around all the time that was needed. You feel me? Um, 
But you got to grow out of that shit. Like, you're not a child no more. You feel me? And uh, you got to kind of understand what goes on in life. You kind of let go of your feelings and your emotions and what you feel. And sometimes even what you what you heard or what you've been told or what you've been taught, sometimes you got to let, let go of that shit and kind of let lo logic take the wheel and, and, and steer shit, you feel me? Because everything ain't what you believe. 